What up, it's your girl Nick. Back like I never left. Everybody sound the same, why they imitating? Me, I'm spitting the real with no imagination. Better give it all you got if we collaborated. Alright, y'all. I'm back at it, y'all. I'm really upset. I'm upset. I'm upset. You know why? Because I haven't been to the gym in a week, y'all. And it's for a good reason. I had to go out of town. Ah, my door. It's windy out here. I had to go out of town to take care of my pops. He had a heart attack. I'm going to post a little clip in here that I recorded uh, the other day that I did not post on my channel. Just because so much stuff was going on, y'all. Like, I didn't even have time to give you guys a life update. But check out this clip right quick. And I'm about to go on the gym. After y'all check out the clip, we're going to get right to this workout. All right, let's get it. Y'all, I am in Corpus Christi, Texas. I didn't get a chance to give you guys a life update because my life has been chaotic for the last three weeks. Um, whew, where do I start? Okay, first off, we had the death of Nipsey Hussle, right? That was about three weeks ago. Um, definitely put me in a lower mood wasn't as happy you know what I'm saying and then uh, a couple days after I get a phone call from one of my cousins she tells me that our little cousin passed away in a tragic car accident so I had to go to the funeral and the wake and all that you know it's a lot to take in energy wise and I'm sorry if y'all are getting a lot of background noise. I am currently on a road trip almost to my destination. I'm going, I'm on my way to Corpus Christi. I'm pretty much already here. Anyways, yeah, sorry for the background noise, guys. But yeah, so I go to the funeral and it's just very emotional for the whole family. He was only 19 years old. Tragic, man. It was hard. So that happened. And then the day of the funeral, which is the same day Nipsey Hussle got buried too. So I'm like, man, both funerals at once. It's just a lot going on. And while we're at the funeral, my godson has an asthma attack and we have to rush him to the hospital. And of course, you know, like I'm worried, stressed out, but he's okay. So a few days after that, I get a phone call. And it's my dad's ex-wife telling me that he just had a heart attack and he is now in the hospital. And I'm like freaking out, you know, I'm in Dallas, eight hours away from him. And it just really threw the whole week off. Um, I'm finally getting to my dad's house or I'll be there in about five minutes. Just got to Corpus. Yeah, that's pretty much uh, my life update for you guys, man. Like. I don't know, it's just been uh, one crazy last three weeks. I appreciate all the love, all the prayers y'all have sent me. Like, my dad pulled through, he's out of the hospital now, and uh, like he got released today, literally about 30 minutes ago. So I'm excited to see him, and I'm kinda happy to be here in Corpus Christi, you know? I grew up here for a little part of my life, and it, I'm getting the hometown vibe as I'm riding through the city. But yeah, guys, I'm about to be at my dad's house, check on him, make sure he's doing okay, spend a couple days with him. And if I do anything fun, I'll bring y'all along. Y'all already know. But like I said, thank you guys so much for praying for my dad. Those of y'all who knew about it on Twitter or Facebook, I didn't say anything on YouTube yet. I know some of y'all don't have social media. So I'm telling you right now, sorry for the delay. But thank you for the prayers. And because my dad pulled through. He's a survivor and a fighter. So, as you can see, Coach O has already taken off on sliders. It's a core workout, and it is hard. Y'all gonna see mine, and I, I struggle with it. But Coach O has a lot of upper body strength, which I'm working on right now. You see that I am doing the burpee to shoulder press, and I'm already sweating, y'all. The workout just got started. I'm red in the face and everything, y'all. And now I just realized that I'm in Coach O's camera screen. So uh, yeah, I'm about to go move my camera right quick. Be right back. All right, so I had to do my burpees over here. Get out of her recording. <laughs> the struggle was real, y'all. Like after a week, 
I was tired. So I only had to do those until she got back. Now it's time for me to do my sliders. Okay, don't judge me because <laughs> you know I haven't worked out in a week. And this is a lot of body to be dragging, boy. I'm like, I think I got it going on right here. And also I hurt my thumb. I jammed my thumb like many times playing basketball. So this one was kind of hard for me to hold my body weight on my thumb, on my hand, you know? So I know Coach O was like, I know she better finish these damn sliders. But yeah, I'm struggling over here. The slider slipped off my foot. So yeah, you just kind of got to push through it. Look, you see how Coach O style, she like, uh-uh, you better be doing that workout. I see you think I ain't looking. But yeah, that's pretty much me struggling the whole way, sliding on down, and then you just gotta run back, and then we're gonna switch. So you'll do that workout three times down and back. Ready? And 15. What up, Mob Squad? So I just woke up, so my locks are looking like whatever. So don't judge me, I don't really care. Forgot to close it out with a recap last night. About, forgot to close it out with a recap yesterday about my workout, but my workout went great. Um, I was a little bit discouraged because I came back like with more weight after staying at my dad's house and I got on the scale and I weighed more. And today, after my workout, literally I weighed back to what I was wanting. So really had no reason to be upset about it, I guess. Just had to work towards it. Anyways, we're about to go to LA in two days. So we're about to shop and pack and do all these last minute things. I gotta find someone to watch Dallas because so far I don't have anyone. I gotta go get a haircut. Les has to get her hair done. Les has to go get her nails done. It's just so much stuff that has to happen in like two days. So yeah, that's where I'm gonna be. That's why you haven't seen a video and that's why I missed Motivation Monday um, yesterday, guys. But it's all good. We're gonna vlog while we're in LA. We're gonna do a meetup and announce the meetup location. So we have so many things going on, more videos to come. But yeah, Mob Squad, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell right next to the subscribe button so you can get notified when I upload on my channel. Smash the like button while you at it. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Until next time, Mob Squad. Nothing less than I would You can never knock me off I know you